the same time tonight, a West Michigan charity working in Syria has switched its efforts from development to relief. This, as the UN Refugee Agency says, tens of thousands of civilians in the country are now seeking safety. News 8's Emily Leonard is in studio control with more on how this organization is helping. Well, Sue and Brian, Partners Relief and Development is an Ada-based charity that's been working in Syria for years. And over the years, they've been able to reopen six schools, serving more than 2,000 kids. They've also built two medical clinics. They were, we were able to talk with founder and president Steve Goumer today. He says his team did not expect the attacks to unfold as quickly and with as much violence as they have. The team in Syria says more than 100 thousand people are already displaced. Today our team is traveling to uh, some of the affected cities with supplies, uh, mostly blankets, so that the people who are fleeing can be warm through the nights. Um, and also uh, they have vehicles to transport, pe transport people who are on foot. Goumer said that today was going to be an important day to decide how Partners Relief and Development will respond to the crisis on a larger scale. The organization relies on donated funds. If you feel called to give, we've included a link inside our story at woodtv.com. In studio control, Emily Leonard, News 8.